What is up, everyone? Tragic MTG here to do possibly my only box of Time Spiral Remastered. Um, I had recently toyed with the idea of maybe doing the booster box game with this and uh, see if I could exceed the price of this box and maybe go get another one. Except they exploded in price. They've doubled over what I paid for this one. Um, so probably going to just be stuck with this. Let's get into it and see what all the hype is about. Um, people seem to be doing pretty well with these. Uh, it is, I think, possible to get a dud box, but we're just hoping. Let's see. Let's just pop all these out of here. Get a stuffy doll. And some slivers. Hopefully, some big slivers. One of my favorite things to open. Here we go. Draft boosters. Obviously not drafting. Let's just get a little taste of the flavor of these commons here. Trickster Simeon Spirit Guide. So, formerly a big hitter. I'm going to check that as a common in a second here and see uh, how that's doing price-wise. Some cores, some trocare stuff. We got a cryptic annealid, a core dirge, a fury sliver. Oh, we got a legendary land. Flagstones of trocare right there. And a goblin engineer for the time shifted card and a foil. Great. So let's get the scanner going here and scan some of this stuff up and see how I can do. Uh, let's see. Spirit guide. Can you see it? 55 cents. Big. That one has been up and down over the years. Uh, now reprinted down. Let's see the flagstones again. One it's been reprinted recently. 1355 is the ultimate master's version. This new version, five bucks. Yep, so that's going to kind of even out a bit. But that's our first rare. The Goblin Engineer, let's see what it thinks about that. A couple bucks. It's worth keeping. We'll uh, throw it there. And I don't think that foil is going to be much of anything. Let's get a common pile going down here somewhere off to the side. Here we go. Probably a lot of fun to actually draft. Logic not, so let's check it. Common, 30 cents. It's actually like pretty good for a common um, that was just reprinted. Some slivers, you gotta pull the sliver rough and tumble. Whoops, make sure we're on camera. Mycologist and a Magus of the Moon. Uh, let's see here, Magus and a Cranial Plating. Six bucks for the Magus, there we go. Oh, I love these old borders. I'm really hoping for a nice big old border foil out of this box. Cranial Plating, 57 cents is the modern master's version. This one's probably not a whole lot better. Well, maybe. Let me see. What does it think about? Yep, the reprint version with the old border is a buck thirteen, so that's an improvement over the original, I guess. There we go. Here we go, here we go. Virulent sliver, that's one that I normally would pick out of a bulk box. Thirty-two cents for a common. Got a muck drub utopia micon. That's another pickable one. Just 44 cents though. Spellburst and an extra pay. Look at this guy. I always say he's having a bad day. And a courser of crew fix. There's a buck. And the courser. 442. Oh yeah. These are going to be a hit, I think, with the EDH crowd. Throw that one there. Here we go. That one just fell apart. Drakeling, Dream Stalker, very nice. Some creepy zombies there. Episode, Haze of Rage, Meyer Boa, Jota's Avenger, and Ancestral Vision. Sweet, and a Gurmag Angler. The Vision being reprinted. I didn't realize that was printed in a dual deck. Remastered version, four bucks. Too shabby. Gurmag Angler, probably nothing. Wow, I was wrong. Five bucks. So, must be a, I think that must be a popper card, maybe. Throw it there. 
Let's uh, make sure this stuff doesn't just fall all over the place. There we go. Here we go. Go a little quicker here. Gem Hide Sliver will pull that one. Rift Boat will pull that one. Thick Skin Goblin Char Rumbler. Paradise Plume. Maybe pull that one in a pack to the Titan. And a Tamir Battle Rage. That one's nothing big. The Battle Rage. It's a buck. Buck 50. Let's see the Plume. Nope. The Gem Hide Sliver. Nope. And the Rift Bolt. So. Reprinted commons and uncommons like that, um, unless they're super big, I probably am going to stop scanning these up. They're not going to be probably worth it. Here we go. Yeah, we'll, uh, we'll pull it because I think it might be worth buy listing, but I'm not going to scan it. Cloudscape, Big Game Hunter, Arcblade, and a Greater Gargadon. Ooh, and a Lingering Souls. I do like that in the... Uh, old border I actually like the original art better that's just me I like this goblin token that was great look at him look at him go all right here we go oops man these packs just like fall apart like butter all right all right all right the green seeker excellent art boa Cloudscape, Yavamaya Dried, and Angel's Grace with split second. I do like the art on this kind of newer version. Zoltan Boros and a Kasali Pride Mage. There we go. 656. And this is a staple of probably EDH, I guess. Spider Token. Hey, I like those tokens here. All right. Next up. Reflex Sliver, probably nothing big. Might of Old Crosa, so this is one that used to be worth a little bit, but I don't think it is now. I'm wrong. It's a buck thirty-five. That's the original. Hold on. Time shift to twenty-eight cents, so you can see there is a big difference. Um, so maybe these will kind of catch up a little bit. Harmonic Sliver is another one. Uh, yeah, newer version seventy-one. All right, and we got a Tomb Stalker, and it looks like a term Tamir Ascendancy. Tomb Stalker is a buck. The Sentency, almost. Almost. All right. Looking for some big bombs here. Spirit Guide. Chromatic Star. Shivan Meteor. Big Game Hunter. Knight of the Holy Nemesis and a Teleria West. Excellent. And a Field of Ruin. That might be okay. A couple bucks. Six bucks for the field, excellent. All right, let's get him back on camera here. Spinneret sliver, it's pretty decent for a common. Oops. Thick skin goblin, salt crested step, faceless devourer, and a Sarah Avenger classic art there, crystal shard. And, oh, there we go. There's a foil uh, time shifted, a Stonehorn Dignitary. Not one of the big ones. Let's see what it says about that. If it can even recognize it. Yeah, 80 cents is a special as a foil. Oops. 1975, it says. Let's see. When Stonehorn Dignitary enters the battlefield, target opponent skips their next, their next combat phase. That's okay. Probably not a huge one. I'll throw a sleeve on it. Because I'll bet that foil is easy to get messed up. So there we go. Come on, let's get another good time shifted foil. That'd be great. Serpent. Got poultice sliver. Harmonize. Smallpox and periphery nodes and chalice of the void. There we go. That would have been great in foil. 
but it's 40 bucks. Regular, get a sleeve for that one too. There we go. Uh, let's see, what else do I want to do? The Perfume Nodes, a couple bucks, and a Harmonize. Let me check. Nothing big there. All right, third of the way through the box. Muck Drub, Tromp the Domain, Stormcloud Gin, and Ith. High Arcanist and a true name nemesis. There we go. That's pretty good too. So if is 29 cents, the true name with the old border, 12. That's very solid. And a bonded fetch. You like that? Like that uh, sliver token there too. Okay. Moving on. All right. Let's get through this a little faster worm crusader teachings draining whelk and feather the redeemed as an old border that's interesting buck 50 serpent Whoa, 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 whoa. We got a backwards card. What does that mean? It means it's a Mog War Marshal. That's interesting. Very interesting. A little bit of a packing error there. Pendlehaven Elder, Celestial Crusader, Timebender, Extirpate again, and a Dovin's Veto. Okay. Modern Masters version. Right. This one's a dollar. Foil rare. Angel's Grace. Um, okay, let's see if we can get it to go in. Actually, hold on. Let's see if it'll see it. I don't know. We're going to... Let's just do it this way. But being there, we go. Twenty-one bucks. That was worth scanning it in. There we go. All right, let's switch this back. There we go. Back to work. Gem hide. Can never have too many common slivers. Slivers of any kind. Enslave, Dark Heart Sliver, Dormant Sliver, and Teferi, Mage of Zalfir, and a Mole Drifter. Teferi is not this version. 379 and a Moly. Dirt Fish is two bucks. There we go. A couple of apes. Okay. Is it Autumn? Manatai. These are good comments. This will probably be a lot of fun to draft. Cautery Sliver, Skittering Monstrosity, Stone Cloaker, and a Greater Gargadon again. And a Zulaport Cutthroat. Gargadon. A couple bucks for the original. I'm just going to leave it. And then the Cutthroat. It's a buck fifty. Oops, there we go. Pongify, that's a good uncommon. Let's see what it goes for. Commander, reprint. This one's 75 cents. Sand Mage, Conflagrate, and Urborg. There we go. And the time shifted is a disdainful stroke. That Urborg is 17 bucks. Sleeve worthy. There we go. Disdainful Stroke. A little bit, 99 cents. The 
the ignis nightshade assassin saltfield recluse clockwork hydra thelonite hermit and itali uh, let's see that one's nothing big itali primal storm three bucks there we go cool assembly worker look at this guy nice Pottery Sliver, Fireweek Sliver, Urza's Factory, Acroma, they're very nice, and Become a Mint, so Urza's Factory, probably nothing big at this point. Chroma, reprinted a few times, this one is only a dollar, and Become a Mint, that's an Infect card, there it goes. Monkey. I'll probably go back and save out all these good commons here. Guys, Anthem, Sulfur Elemental, Cross and Grip, Sarah Avenger again. I got a duplicate there. Cross and Grip, let's see the new version currently sitting at 74 cents. This will probably go back up. Sarah Avenger and a Mystic Sanctuary. Excellent. <clears throat> Old Border. I don't know. It looks like the. I'd say the printing, the inking on the new old border, it doesn't, I'd have to put this next to a real old border, but this almost looks, it looks like a facsimile. We'll put it that way. But for five bucks, I'll keep it. The Warrens, oops. Griffin Guide, Guys Anthem, Land War Mentor, Summoner's Pact, and the Sculler. Summoner's Pact, now I've been printed a few times, this one's five bucks. And the Sculler, it's a buck or so. Just burning right through this box. Thanks for joining me, by the way, you guys. I always appreciate it. Sam Mage, even Mind Sensor. It used to be a $10 card. Bonded Fetch and a Slaughter Pact. 70 cents now. And a Blood Braid Elf. There we go. It's all adding up. Oops. Uh, yeah, that's not uncommon. Okay, Fire Makavu, Jailer, Time Bender, Periphery Nodes again, and Ancient Stirrings. Hey, that's pretty decent in an old border. Four bucks. Stormfront Riders. It's all about the old borders here, isn't it? Acid. Always like that card. <clears throat> Dread Ship Reef. Mind Sensor again. Monstrosity and a Joyra. And a Reclamation Sage. Bing, bing. All right, two thirds of the way through the box. Let's go. To autumn. Got some kind of um, legendary coming up on Utopia Micon. I'll put that. Riders, Devourer, Kerkeep, and a Farsi. Okay, that's pretty useful. Uh, let's see, nothing big there. 260.
Got a chalice that's pretty good. Looking for just a couple more good hits out of here. It's all been like the $2 and up range. Keen Sense, Force Mage, Avenger, Pact Negation. There you go. That's what I'm talking about. And a Thrag Tusk. 20 bucks. And a Thraggy Poo. It's a dollar. It used to be so big way back when it was first printed in standard. Charm. A Thalid, an Entity, a Salt Blast, and a Drownew, the Lich Lord, and a Manifold Key. Special manifold keys, a buck fifty. The Drifter. Trying to show off the end stuff. Silversmith Delay. So this one is pretty decent. Imperious Soar. Buck seventy five. Came down a bit. And a Benelish Commander. And a Mortify. Eighty-nine cents. Love to get a Sliver Legion. I'm not gonna lie. I'm feeling it. Where is it at? Aramancers, Cloud Cedar, Dune Rider, Hypergenesis. It's a Mythic. Got Suspend, and I got a Vanquisher's Banner. 99 cents for the Mythic of Vanquisher's Banner. That one's 10 bucks. Sleeve it up. Didn't get the big Mythics. Get some medium Mythics. Chromatic Star, Mana Tithe, keep those. Shape of Parasite, Gargoyle, Devourer, Pact of the Titan again, and a Molten Rain. Hmm. A bunch of duplicates here in the rare slot for this box. Some more slivers. Can never have enough slivers. More slivers. Drake, Sudden Death, Rebuff the Wicked, and a Fungus Sliver. I did say I wanted slivers, right? And Alicia. <clears throat> beep, beep, beep. It's not this one. There we go. Alright, coming down to the wire here. Need that one more big thing to just push this over the edge here. Lightning Axe, Reaches, Molten Slag Heap, Coalition Relic, and a Vampire Hex Mage. Relic is a buck. The Hex Mage is probably a buck. Yep. Keep that one. Jin, Furious Liver, Lotus Bloom. I missed a uncommon there, and I got a Johnny's Pride Mate, and a Foil Rare. Reiterate. Let's see if we can see it. Come on, come on. Can you see it? Nope. There we go. Two thirty-eight. Just got one. But it's a foil. Eight fifty-five. All right, that's decent. All right. Wipe away. Keen sense. Riptide pilferer. 
Stuffy doll. And master of the pearl trident. Merfolk lord. Three something. And a foil and slave. Down to two. Premature Burial, Imperious Ore, Harmonic Sliver, and then a regular Reiterate and a Ninja. Ninja of the Deep Hours. He's a buck. Alright, last pack. This is it. Can we get over 300? How did we do? Let me know down below. Like and subscribe. Tragic MTG says, Get me something good. Gauntlet of Power. Hey, there we go. That's good for the closeout. And an Abrupt Decay. Hey, pretty decent pack right there. 1550. And an Old School Decay. Hey, now we're talking. That's what I wanted to close this thing out. Anyway, that's going to do it. Put a couple of sleeves on this. Thanks for watching as always. Catch you later.